Looks like you've gained experience as a Pokemon trainer. You're ready to participate in Pokemon battles. I have three excellent assistants. They each lead a team, and each has a slightly different approach to researching Pokemon. Part of their research is conducting Pokemon battles at gyms. They're excited to have you join as a team member. Pokemon are creatures with excellent intuition. I bet the secret to their intuition is related to how they're hatched. Come on and join my team. You never lose when you trust your instincts. I am Blanche, leader of Team Mystic. The wisdom of Pokemon is immeasurably deep. I am researching why it is that they evolve. My team, with our calm analysis of every situation, we can't lose. I'm Candela, Team Valor's leader. Pokemon are stronger than humans, and they're warm-hearted too. I'm researching ways to enhance Pokemon's natural power in the pursuit of true strength. There's no doubt that the Pokemon our team have trained are the strongest in battle. Are you ready? I'm always Team Valor, man. How are you? It's been a while, hasn't it? You've become quite the trainer. I wanted to ask for your help. As you know, I study Pokemon and their habitats. I've learned a lot over the years, but recently I found some hints of something mysterious. I was wondering if you would help me investigate what's going on. You will? That's great! First things first, let's calibrate my instruments to your area. Could you please complete the following research tasks? Spin five Pokestops or gyms, catch ten Pokemon, and transfer five Pokemon. Okay, sure. Code's here, and today we are back playing some more Pokemon Go. I know this is only my first episode, so I don't know why I'm saying more. Probably because I played it numerous years ago, and haven't played it since until tonight. So yeah, this is Pokemon Go, episode one. I skipped through all the boring stuff, and I'm now level five. The level where, you know, you join a team and whatnot. Yeah, I skipped through all the boring introduction. Just one thing you should know is that I chose Squirtle as my starter. I don't know if I lost all that recording, but that would suck if I did. I don't know why that keeps happening. But it does, and it's really annoying. I keep somehow losing footage. Don't know what happens, but yeah. Yeah, basically it's like 11 o'clock at night and I'm out playing Pokemon Go for the first time in years. On a new account. Interesting life choices. With codes. We have a Pokemon. Oh, that's a horrible throw. I'm not going to catch it with that. Knew it. Yes, there we go. Nice throw. Not quite a great throw, so it won't count, which sucks. But at least we get the small nice throw boost in terms of experience. We got ourselves a pokey stop. Hey, I earned a medal. Nice. Alright, and that is that, my friends. Level six. Where's that one pokey stop there? I don't know why, but something's telling me it's down this alley. And we have a Kangaskhan. Let's get that and let's get out of this alley because it seems quite shady, if you ask me. I mean, it's just a driveway, I know. But you can't be too careful at like 8 o'clock at... No, not 8 o'clock. 11 o'clock at night. And I did just break the streak again. And Kangaskhan broke free because of it. Oh my gosh, my throws are horrible. Great throw, finally. Another great throw, please. Oh, a pothole. Nice.
All right, let's head back further into the CBD. Let's grab a few pokey stops and then let's head home. Actually, to get some eggs incubating up in here. Also, we have a Zangoose. It's decided to rear his head. Yes, we got a great throw. Oh, yay, network problems. Gotta love it. There we go. It's all good, fam. We earned a medal, boys. There's a bit of traffic out. Let's head over to the post office, which is a gym. Has been for years. Oh, is that a cockroach? That's a cockroach. Like a real life cockroach. <laughs> wow. You know, going out playing Pokemon Go at this time of night, you encounter way more than just Pokemon creatures. You encounter the real life kind. Surely we're within range of it now, huh? Jim Badger and nice. Is it full? Yeah, I think the gym is full. Let's just feed some berries to the weakening Pokemon. Yeah, okay, that should do it. Don't want to overfeed you guys. We got some kids skating down the street. How cool is that? Well, not skating, scootering. But still, that's pretty cool. Hey, look at that. We have a minin. Or a minin. However you want to pronounce it. I'm sure it's fine either way. Great throw! Yes, we did it, boys! We got the three great throws in a row. Let's go. And there we have it. We just need to catch one more Pokemon. And we've completed another field research. Let's claim our reward for that. Oh, oh, oh. All right, we've got an Onyx, boys. Let's uh, feed him up with a Nano Berry. Great throw. Let's go. All right, let's go, let's go. Yes! Let's go, fam! Let's go! We just caught that Onyx like it's 1999. Oh, my throws are getting better. Let's head down that alley again. Because, like, I kind of want to. Because there's a pokey stop down here, you know. Honestly, this game is so addicting. I can see why I used to love it. The professor wants to speak to us. Codes, it's always great to see you. I'm sure you know this, but your help in progressing my research has been essential to major breakthroughs in my work. Thank you. That's why I've come to talk to you again. You probably already know what I'll be asking. No, I don't. I need your assistance in learning more about newly discovered Pokemon that has recently sent me and the other Pokemon researchers into quite a tizzy. Can you believe an undiscovered Pokemon just appeared out of the blue? You can imagine how everyone is talking about it. I was checking in a nearby habitat when I ran into a nest of them, and I was so excited I dropped my camera. Don't worry though, I'm sure the repairs won't cost me too much at the shop. Although each Pokemon turned out to be a ditto, using the move Transform. That didn't put a damper on my day. 
so many Ditto taking on this unique Pokemon form must mean that the real Pokemon is truly out there, just waiting to be found. Let's get to work, Codes. I know we don't have much to go on, but I'm confident your hard work can bring us good fortune. But first, let me recalibrate my instruments for your area. Could you please complete the following task? Spin five Pokestops or gyms, catch ten Pokemon, transfer five Pokemon. Oh my gosh, there's creatures everywhere. Like, in real life. <laughs> How funny is that? So now, what we should do is we should be heading home. Because I feel like in the midnight hour, it's not a good time to be out. So, yeah, man. Let's head home and let's play some more tomorrow. Also, one more thing. This is my first time even playing a video game, even touching a video game in many years. Like, well, not many years, but over a year. So. You can imagine how big of a thing this is for me. My first time touching a video game in over a year, let alone putting it on YouTube. A gameplay of it. Alright, we've got another Zangoose. There seems to be a lot of them. Maybe we can transfer some for candies. Another great throw. We are getting so much better at this. All right, nice. All right, everyone, I just got home, and it's 11.22. So a big night of playing Pokemon Go deserves a big night of sleep, I think. I'll edit this video possibly either now or in the morning. In fact, I'm hungry. I might make myself some dinner. So I'll make myself some dinner, edit this video simultaneously, and then, yeah, this will be uploaded tomorrow morning uh, as of right now as i'm recording this it'll be tomorrow morning yeah seems about right <laughs> all right if you guys did enjoy today's video remember to leave a like and subscribe and tap that notification bell so you never miss an upload by me and i guess i'll see you all in the next video goodbye